The roads in Memphis are pretty dry tonight, but don't be fooled. A taste of winter is just hours away, folks. Thanks for joining us. I'm Richard Ransom. And I'm Katina Rankin. We're talking about a wintry mix of rain, sleet, and snow all headed our way and just bringing a huge drop in temps. As a matter of fact, I've got my coffee ready for it. <laughs> Chief Meteorologist John Bryant tracking the storms, and he joins us now. So, John, what kind of a drop are we talking about? We're talking about a drop of 30 to 35 degrees in just a matter of hours. That's a huge drop. Now, the good news is the ground is still warm from temperatures in the 60s to around 70, but you can see uh, the green on the radar here. None of that is frozen. It's all liquid with temperatures that are well above freezing everywhere, but the rain is going to increase throughout the evening, late evening, and overnight hours. We have dropped now into the 50s, so the cold front is through Memphis. It's 52 in Jonesboro, but still a long way to go until we hit that freezing mark. And as a matter of fact, the winds are really starting to pick up out of the northwest at 23 in Jonesboro. That's a sign that the colder air is beginning to build into the Mid-South. So what's going to happen? Let's advance the future cast overnight. Rain chances pick up. By 6 a.m., we could see a transition, a changeover from rain to a mixture of rain and snow, possibly some sleet. You see the pink there? That is the frozen precipitation. Numbers, though, still above freezing. And keep in mind, the ground will still be relatively warm as it won't have a lot of time to cool off. Now, if this continues throughout the late morning and temperatures fall, there could be some accumulation on grassy surfaces. But this is not a big snowstorm, but any kind of uh, snow in Memphis and the Mid South is always a talker, always a big deal. We'll tell you about any implications travel wise uh, later in the broadcast and just how cold it's going to be following this cold front coming up in a few minutes. All right. John, thank you.